hi everyone and you're going to join me and a couple of friends for an explore of one of London's deep level air aid shelters. Hope you're going to enjoy this one. In we go. Join us inside. Good evening ladies and gents and you join me and a couple of friends. Shall I go in front if I record it? Me and a couple of friends inside chairs, inside one of London's deep level air aid shelters. Bit of a climb down, but in there, look, it's the old World War II elevator, which I've actually seen someone use. It does work, but I would not want to do that. Fascinating, isn't it? Really interesting, these places. Once you get down, like, right down in there, there's, there's the original bunk beds and all that. You could arrive here on a train or through one of the several entrances. Yeah, they're in my zip up pocket. Yeah, uh, let me just pause and I'll. It's, uh, it's one of the deepest shelters. Yeah. When the flying bombs started coming over, and they knew about flying bombs and stuff, I mean, they, this was built by the time the war really started, 1940, 41, but they knew that they was gonna be facing some real shit that needed deep level shelters. I can't lie, this way is much easier, easier to get in. Yeah, wouldn't it, Charles? Yeah, we had a much easier climb in this time. Someone had kindly thrown a piece of carpet over a razor sharp gate, so. Yes, yeah, just most convenient. Well, these before, what the andrail's gone? Yeah. Nah, a bit of uh, deterioration. Water's getting in, isn't it? A lot of how they kept this place dry years ago was with uh, Welsh suit sealing the joints of Welsh flannel and lead. Apparently, I read up about it. It's so deep down that you couldn't hear any of the bombs dropping, really, unless they landed on one of the shafts. This is built exactly how they built railway tunnels, isn't it, really? And how quick they built it as well, it's amazing. Yeah, I think they, they may well have done. There's rumours that a man got buried alive in the concrete. We are at the bottom. Look at the elevator shaft. Yeah, guys and girls, that's the original elevator. In there. Look at these buttons. Cheers, eh? Should we show... Uh, I've got a spare phone on me as well, so you'll like this in your abs, I think. They may have switched the generator off at the other end, mate. This here is one of the great fans that to vent this place. And apparently it was cold as hell when you were in here. And where we're going to walk on now is a vent tunnel that takes you down into the the railway, right into the railway tunnels down there. Some idiot climbed down that. Fuck like that. Do be careful, you two, would you? Sorry to sound like a naggy old lady, but I am the oldest one of us, because I thought some. I don't know if you want to risk this. Fuck no, that. No, that was old. Oh no, Brandon, look what someone's done. Oh, someone broke the bulb. Someone smashed the bulb. Look, do you remember that bulb? Yeah. What a cunt. Why would you do that? Yeah. Sorry, I got my language, guys and girls. There was a beautiful, um, original World War II great big bulb that fired everything for the generator, and someone's took, smashed the bulb or stolen it. Alex, that's been nicked. 
assholes. The in here, look, this is uh, the engine, and it would get so hot that it had to have a, a fire water system on it. And if it caught fire, you'd pull that, pull the lever, and the water would pump out and put the fire out in the engine. That is trains, if you can hear them. It's going to pause you a sec, guys. Original World War II bed frames. But you'll see all the, uh, the bed frames. Ah, this is where we went in for here, mate, wasn't it? When we found... Uh, is it the room at the end here? Yeah, they, after, this, after the war... This was turned over and uh, as a document store for do government documents. No, it weren't this one. So yeah, there's a little room that you go in like this. Right, and I think you... Before our torches started dim, mm. we'd be in the out, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Because you don't want to be down here. No, right? absolutely not. I've got a spare phone on me with a tool which is fully charged with a light, so I've made double sure. That is not so yeah. No, I think it was this one, wasn't it? Yeah, it's this one, Brandon. This is what takes us down into the deep level shelter that we went into before. Remember the manhole cover was up and we saw a newspaper under there, didn't we? I think you'll, li I think you'll like this bit abs uh, at the end of here, wouldn't you, mate? Was it here? Where the hell did we get through? Keep going further down. Yeah. Plug sockets and everything. You could charge your phones up and whatnot in here and what, everything. had sick bays and dormitories and this is like the rooms that we're going into but as I say after the war it was turned over to the uh, document storage this is it this is where the original beds are like in there yeah ah oh, brilliant no that's we went right through the end of that Oh, yeah, look. Do you know I said we never did this bit, didn't I? We didn't, no. We did that bit. We did this, we did that bit. We went through this way because there's a great, uh, this is one of the rooms where they, all the people slept. There's another one of these below. There's a, there's a door at the end of this, but this is one of the great dormitories. Did I? Did you, one of you just say something? Yeah. Ah, oh, good for that. Oh, yeah. It's up to you, mate. I don't mind. I've got chalk with me if you want to chalk up at all or anything. Child stuff toy, look. It's not creepy, is it? No, no, that's what I just thought it was quite sinister. There's some poor homeless beggar with a kid's been sleeping down here. That's one of the fire uh, hydrant things. That and doesn't work. No, I tried yeah, it. tried that last time. This torch will go for about six hours. That one for about three. What you've got, Abs has got. I've got a phone with a light with a torch, uh, charged up with torch as well, so. I've made damn sure, because fucking getting lost down here, can you imagine it? We have been lost down here. Yes. It's easy to get lost. You've been watching the videos, haven't you? Yeah. Easy. I love it, man. I love it. I love it. It's fascinating, isn't it? Like, you think the history that would have gone on down here. Madness. Look, there's still paperwork and stuff.
You may bump into other explorers. Funny enough, do you know they said this is one of the few places in London where there ain't a load of rats? Huh? Yeah. yeah Could be. I can't see why there wouldn't be. Someone said about it on one of the videos, but I can't see why there wouldn't be rats down here. It'd be easy to get into. Takes you up to one of the uh, old original train, the entrances that you could have come in on the train. So people, when they finished work, they'd book up here, like, for the, forever long they wanted to stay, and they'd just arrive each night with their ticket. And, yeah. This is A to E bank down there. And here you're looking at a real, genuine piece of history that hasn't been touched since World War Two. Is all right. London is the centre of the universe. England rule the world. Well, if we can go that far, they do no, used to once. Yeah, some yeah, sure people just would have sat there. These are the airlock doors and stuff. And this goes further down. Ah, here we are. We're in uh, one of the banks. That takes you up into more space like that. 96 fees. Sorry. Mm. 1996. I'm Schedule. Schedule agreement inside between the Chartered Institute of Management Accountants. Fucking hell. This is where we went down before, wasn't it? Yes, I was in there. This takes you into another shelter, which I didn't know about. Yeah, we can do if you like. And stuff for that, you pick. It's entirely up to you, Abs. I don't mind, but I'll fuck that. I don't give a fuck. But this way will take you like through where the banks are and you'll go to like an original train station entrance. Fuck. But it's all boarded up, like it's got kick Yeah, it's boarded, dude. But you need the beds, yeah? Yeah, that's the beds. Yeah. If you lift up the boards, some of them, you can see the old. Are we? Sweet. Oh yeah, so we have. Oh look, you lift up that bit of board, Abs. And that's the old yeah. wire framing for the beds under there. That ain't a proper bit of World War II history. Is there a light switch there? Because there's lights down here. Yeah. Oh, we can turn our torches off now. How convenient. That's it. Oh, how kind. Have you turned this off? Just, cl uh, it closed, just push it down. That's it. Sweet. Yeah, save the battery. Yeah, see, in case we need them. Yeah, it's God, I'm fucking sweating. Isn't it warm? <laughs> Interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Thousands of people, this. Uh, Housed every night, the small bunks up there are for the kids. So you'd have mum, dad, kids. Fuck, that's not big enough for two people in there. I know, but. Yeah, it's even wicked even if someone's had a tisky for us. <laughs> <laughs> World War II, mate, you'd be fucking glad to get down here and away from it all. Especially when the V2s and whatnot started coming, V1 and V2 flying bombs started coming. Oh, yeah. What's that? Do you want to pause this quickly? Yeah, hang on. I think we should do, um, what's it called? Spillers. It's an old um, flower factory at the docks, but it's fucking fascinating. Yeah, we show him on the way yeah we'll show you some pictures in that. Actually, I'll tell you what, it on the way yeah, I only wish that we could go back in time to when I was a teenager, because that was fascinating. Like the office area in there, do you know it still had original desks and paperwork and... Yeah, it's warm, isn't it? Imagine the what, man? Apparently, apparently, when they put those big vents on, it became so cold, Danny, you had to bring your winter clothes with you. Yeah.
Amazing, isn't it? You think that they would have arrived? Thousands down here. There's a lot of info in, of, of it online and stuff as well. So we just have to. Yeah. And I showed him the pictures, and he was like, he started sending me all of the exploring stuff. <laughs> he wants to move outside. Well, no, no, no. He's like. That's a bit of interesting history. Look, our location, the fire procedure for where we are. Abs, this is from 1945. That's look, amazing. Look how mint condition that is. Like a time warp, isn't it, down here in some ways? Yeah. Look, there's more of it down here that just goes on and on to all different level, like, areas. Fascinating. Nah, not down here. Shit, look at all the old electrics in here. The amazing thing is it still works. Okay, so... Which way do we go? Yeah. Or which way did we go? We, we carried on going straight. Did we go right? straight? More and more beds. Thousands of people it must have housed in here. Sorry, Ops. That's amazing. I've been here before and it just still amazes me. See how close we are to the railway line. The only thing is, the only thing is, I don't want to start turning and we're going to get lost. Yeah. Yeah. Because if you turn down. Yeah, we did, did get a bit lost last time, didn't we? Down, yeah. yeah. Ah, yeah. excellent. There we are. Cheers, mate. Can chalk up if you want. I've got some chalk. Did you want to do that? Please identify where we chalked up because look over the chalk everywhere. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure we'll be alright. <clears throat> if not, they'll just find three emaciated skeletons down here, won't they? So I've only got one bottle of water between the pair of us. Look at the old plugs at the old guy. This is when I'm one of the, uh, the toilet areas. Careful where you're walking, mate, just in case there's any asbestos there. Uh, I just want to see the bottom of Or in case there's a, a drop. Yeah, someone drove a big cock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're obligatory. Every, ex well, apart from the churches that I do, thank God you don't see those in there, but pretty it's much. Pretty never, possibly. Under there is the, all the original. Yeah, you have to take that in stages, don't you? This is one of them ones you just wouldn't tire of. Okay, someone's done a chalk marker. That's I think that was ours. That's our chalk. Yeah. That was us. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, early December last year, yeah. It is, yeah, because you forget, don't you? Like, and I don't always watch my own videos back and that. I'll proof watch them if I need to, if there's people about and shit, but this I won't have to proof watch. But I don't like hearing my own voice. It sounds weird hearing your own voice, doesn't it? No, I won't. Yeah, it's too hot. <laughs> Rats. Where? I heard them squeak. No, that was me pushing that. Ah, oh, thank God for that. I don't mind many things, but rats, I'd be tucking my uh, trousers into my socks. That's a, a myth, actually. What, that they run up your trouser lids? I'd run away from you, I mean, I wouldn't want to run up someone's trouser leg, but you never know, do you?
this combo. We can do many if you want. Yeah. Okay, so I don't remember this now. I thought we went to the end, but we could have gone round one of the sideways or something. But we didn't want to. No. Remember we said just keep it straight? Yeah. I could be wrong. Can you imagine, like, it's crazy to think, isn't it, coming down here, wondering, shoot, is my house and stuff going to be there when I get back? True. Oh, do you remember when I did that, <laughs> played that recording of an air raid siren down here, yeah, didn't it go like, weird? That just gave a creeps. Yeah, that freaked me out a bit, I wouldn't do that again. A metal tag thing, I thought it might have been a badger of some kind or whatnot, but no. Have you got actually got a signal down here? No. I'd be, I'd be stunned if you got a signal down here. You do on the tubes nowadays. Yeah, I know, yeah. They were up to cables, didn't they? Yeah. I think it was something like 11,000 or something like that that this housed. Because there's an, an below us and above us, there are other levels like this. If I remember correctly, that's a dead end, Luke. Hmm. Didn't we go one of these ways? No. No. I don't remember going this way with these cages, do you? No. Yeah. This side, all beds on either side. Why the cage stop? Because when they turned it over to a document store, uh, they put the cages up so each firm would come down here and manage its documents and that. It was till fairly recent, well, early 2000s, that parts of it were still being used. Do you know what I find most disgusting? What? No one's dusted. <laughs> it's fucking filthy, isn't it? Could you imagine being tasked to clean this up? It would take months. It would. Fucking hell. Yeah. It could be all though, wouldn't it? Yeah, thousands. <laughs> Interesting, isn't it? <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah. So we go. I think I remember it. Well, we know we've just gone one in one straight line, don't we? So we should be alright. Yeah, it's probably better like that. And there's so much to explore as well, isn't there? So, oh, you've got an original fire bucket here, look. One of the old World War II red fire buckets. And it's still got writing and stuff on it. Fire. That's mad, isn't it? It's, it looks a lot better on the screen than it does with the eyesight, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I've been these stairs because we going up. Do you remember Luke? Vaguely. To be honest, no. Do you remember these? Which way did we go? This is where we go past. If you remember correctly, if we go this way. Mm -hmm. Remember how identical Yeah. Yeah, that takes us down into the replica of that and that. 
So that's pretty much it. She just goes in a big circle. Yeah. Which way do you want to head? Yeah. I don't care. Let's try M, see what's down in M. Here you go, brother. I dressed thinking it was going to be cold, I'm fucking sweating. No, it's me with my torch on the door. Me, me. Oh. Me. Wind. <laughs> it is. Three years. That's quick. They started it late thirties and it was done by forty forty one. Wow. Because they knew the war was coming, like because Hitler was kicking off and shit. And that stuff had, he'd um, Putin, isn't yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff he'd done in uh, Poland and whatnot. And they knew that he was just edging for an excuse because they after the First World War we basically raped Germany really and they never forgave us for it. Yeah. That's why the Second World War happened. You could technically, I think. You get what I'm saying, isn't it? Yeah. It's probably best to go the way you've come, though, so you don't get lost. It's easy to get lost in here, you know. Some of them got lost. Yeah. How long did it take them to get back? About a half a day, apparently. Shut up. Yeah, and they was in a real state when they got out. <laughs> you start panicking in that, didn't you? Yeah, of course. Yeah, vaguely. Well, we found our way out last time, so. If worse comes to worse, hit one of the fire alarms and someone will come down and rescue you. 94. Cool, look. 1994. I would have been 10 years old. Look in good condition it is, look. That's mad. <laughs> oh, it's got no page 3 models. Yeah. Pre-register for legend, Leisure Build 95. You weren't even born. No, no. Oh. This goes on for miles. Not in this one. Do you know anyone who's done this by themselves? No, no, I don't. No, I was advised not to do it on my own. I was toying with the idea of doing it on my own, and then I found out Brandon wanted to come. But I think had I got in and seen it, I probably would have come out because I don't think it's a good idea to do this on your own. Imagine if something happens, like you've got no reception, nothing. This is one of the old ARP stations, this is. Yeah, it's got modern day perks. Yeah, it would do. It's got modern day electrics and shit in there now. Look at the old one, man. There's it all there. Someone's busted through into the whole room. Go forward a bit, mate, because I'm standing on some boards so you don't feel too. And I'm not light. <laughs> Dead end? Yeah. Ah. Well, we can head back and uh, carry, get back to where we were and carry on straight because we... Rather, you know when we went through that big room? Yeah. Instead of going through there, if you carry on, it takes you up to the other stair... Oh! Shit, I didn't yeah. see that. Yeah. Take you up to the uh, other stairway. What's down there? I don't know. Yeah. 
No, we have not been here before. Yeah, we have, because I remember that writing on the wall. I've clocked it. That's just a YouTuber. Yeah. He tags himself everywhere. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so what I mean, how easy we... Yeah. Here we go, Luke. Cheers, man. Should we just go back the way we came? Yeah, you can do, and then head on straight at the other stairwell or something, if you want. There's plenty to explore, anyway. Okay. Well, why did we go? Oh look, there's a document vault, look. You turn these and it closes them up. I wonder if it works. Yeah? <laughs> That's crazy, isn't it? Vault 4. That's amazing, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Joining me for part two.